What's going on guys? Gage here with Outdoor Instincts Live. Today's saltwater video, I'm going to show you guys how to properly introduce a new fish into your marine aquarium. Uh, today I am actually introducing a royal blue tang, uh, Dory, uh, to my saltwater tank. So what I'm going to show you guys here goes the same with uh, as it does with you know fish, corals, invertebrates. You all do this the same way. Um, basically, what you're going to do is you're going to float your fish, and you float your fish for a good, oh, I'd say at least a half an hour. She's been floating for approximately a half an hour. Um, as soon as I pick the fish up, you know, when I take it home, I just take the whole unopened bag and I stick it right in the top of the aquarium. I just kind of let it, you know, bob around and float around for about a half an hour. This allows whatever it is you're introducing, fish, coral, invert, it allows it to get used to the temperature of your tank. Because, you know, maybe the store didn't have it at the ideal temperature, maybe, you know, through shipping, handling, or the car ride home, it's, it's gotten cold. So, we're going to introduce this to the tank now. Uh, after letting your fish float for approximately a half an hour, um, what I personally like to do, which I'm going to show you here, is I like to cut off the top of the bag, and then I clip it to the side of the tank. Now, there's lots of ways of going about this. Another way that you can do this is using a bucket and a drip loop which you would just take a piece of tubing and you put it into your tank and you would start a siphon and you would tie a knot in the end of the tube and just let the water from your tank slowly drip into the water that your fish came with from the store. Nothing wrong with that. However, what I'm going to show you here today, I like a little bit better. So, after your fish has had time to float, what you're then going to do is you're going to take a turkey baster and you're going to remove some of the water from the bag that the fish came in. Okay. And then we're going to put that in our bucket. Okay, and we're going to do a little bit more here. Okay. We're going to repeat this process here just a couple times. Okay, now what we're going to do, after we've done that, is we're going to take some water from my tank and we're going to put it into the bag. And what this is doing is this is letting your fish now adjust to the water that's in your tank. Um, there's still some water in there from the, from the store, which is perfectly fine. So we're letting the fish now adjust to the water from our tank along with the water that it still has that it's used to from the fish store. And you just repeat this process until you know you have most of the, of the uh, store water out and your tank water in. So hope you guys learned something. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, you know, share. Uh, if you guys have any questions or comments, let me know. Thanks, guys. Bye.